Okay. Well, eight, eight weeks ago today, that was on the fr Friday the 6th of May, um, woke up as normal at home. Nicola said she felt a bit different. So I went downstairs and made her a cup of tea and brought it back up. As I walked round to her side of the bed, she got out of bed to go to the toilet. And as she got out, she collapsed and I caught her. Um, straight away I recognised as a, a stroke because the way her head flung back, um, dragged her into the bathroom, kept talking to her and made her comfortable. And we got taken to State Mandeville Hospital Maternity Unit where she was monitored for 24 hours. I suppose it was about four o'clock in the afternoon. They came through and said to us that she's got a, had a bleed on the brain um, and she was being transferred by ambulance where she'd be having an emergency C-section under general anaesthetic to get Lexi out because she was obviously at risk with Nicola being so ill. Um, so we got here about seven o'clock and Lexi was born quarter to midnight that, that night. 12 hours later, Nicola was obviously still in the maternity unit um, and then she was transferred over to the neurology ward. She spent four weeks here one machines and she had 19 drips going into her, she had 10 machines on her, she got pneumonia and then she got moved into a normal stroke ward uh, where, where I'm pleased to say now she's got a bit of movement in her right hand so she can actually clench her fist and she can eat and she can talk um, and she's got nothing at all plugged into her or attached to her for the first time in what, eight weeks so it's, they kept her alive, they saved her life. And that's what I'm, I'm so thankful and that's why, that's why I'm back here today to, to present the cheque.